Hey guys, today I'm going to be doing a Let's Play on Plants vs. Zombies. Hopefully this will tell you if you want it or if you don't. Enjoy. Pretty much, this is Plants vs. Zombies. If any of you want to know, I am recording this off of my computer, not off of the Apple iPod. <clears throat> because the Apple iPod isn't the best thing to be recording off of. I can record off of it, but I don't prefer to. I will be doing that for other apps, though. Um, pretty much this is Plants vs. Zombies. All you have to do is collect sun and buy plants. Um, I suggest getting it. It is fun. It's not a live action RPG though. It is not like sitting there on the edge of your seat blowing people's heads off. It's pretty much a laid back fun game. Say if you want to go on the, if you're going on the airplane and you need something to do for an hour and a half and you want to play like four or five levels. This will keep you accompanied for a long time. So I hope you enjoy this. Um it's if you get it off of Steam, I think it's about four dollars off of Steam. But if you get it within the Christmas special, it is around two two fifty nine or something like that. On the app store, I think it I don't know what it is. I think it's two ninety nine or something like that. I'll put an annotation at the top screen to tell you um how much it is. This is this is pretty much it. This is only the first beginning levels though. Don't think this is everything. This is just the beginning. You get a, uh, this is a sunflower. It looks like the sunflower plant. And it gives you sun. And you get the sun from the air, from the sun, a bit originally, and you get the sun from them. It gives you additional sun. I think you only have to play four levels to get, no, three levels. You have to play three levels and you'll get all your land. The more land you get, the harder it is. Um, at the beginning of each level, I suggest getting a sunflower and putting them all in the back rows of plants. All on the back rows of your land. Because one, you'll get more sun faster and you'll be able to get more pea shooters. Two, because it'll protect your your house. Also, if you are, um, if, if zombies somehow get through and like you're not fully protected and not ready to put anything else down and they get through and they hit a lawnmower, the lawnmower will kill every zombie on that road, not just that one. But the lawnmower does not come back. You see, the lawnmower disappears after one use. And if those same zombies, if different zombies come and they get past them and they and there's already a uh, lawnmower gone, already used, then they can just walk into your house and eat your brains. That's what they do. That that's exactly what they do. It doesn't show you them eating your brains, but it says the zombies ate your brains. That's pretty much it. And then you have to restart the level to get past the new one. Pretty cool sound effect. The more sunflowers you have, the more plant, the more sun you will get, the more plants you can buy. Yeah, this is pretty much this. Final waves come more and more during levels. They uh you get you can get up to four final waves. This is called a 
cherry bomb and it blows up all the zombies in an area around that area these zombies with cones on their hands have a protective layer it's like two zombies together but it's just one zombie with a cone on its head when you shoot the zombie enough the cone will fall off but the zombie still as strong as any other zombie brand new so it's pretty much shooting two zombies That's what happens when a zombie gets too close. It starts to eat your plant, and if it eats it, if if you have it there long enough for it to eat too long, the plant will disappear. Like is that? Oh, maybe not. We oh, got saved at the last second. They'll pretty much disappear. Nothing special. That's what a cherry bomb does. This is called a walnut. It's pretty much a wall that you put in front of any of your uh, plants. It's like a barrier. And it takes a while for the zombies to eat them, probably around a minute or so. And most of the time, you shoot the zombies off before they can get to it. Um, so, I'll show you one more thing. This is what your yard looks like when it's completely full, full, when it's completely filled with grass. This is your yard. I'm not gonna play this level because I'm running short of time. But guys, that's pretty much Plants vs. Zombies. I will be doing more uh, Let's Plays. Both me and my friend Parker. We will be both doing more Let's Plays and we will do more Minecraft, multiple other games. Uh, Terria is coming up and we're also going to have Spore. Uh, other, all hundreds of different things. Uh, don't forget to subscribe and if you want us to check out your map, send us a message and we'll send us down the link link and we will download it and we'll try it out and post it on our channel thank you and goodbye